for me, I really liked the co-design process. I thought it was really good for the staff and they all got to, you know, say how they felt about the project. The most useful would have been the better pre-applications um, and the, the process timeline. So indicating to our community what our expectations are of them to help us to make a, a more efficient, better solution. And it was really good to engage with our key stakeholders in our own council and talk to, I guess, uh, staff members who aren't planners mm -hmm. and hear, uh, I guess, their ideas around what they think uh, planning processes are and what they should look like and how they should be involved. I thought that was really, um, really good in terms of building those relationships and hearing from them. Well, the three things that we've got, we've developed are the, um, the, the user guide for the start planners, the internal referrals information on the website, um, and the information sheets for the website for customers to know what makes a valuable submission. So actually that's quite neatly three things that what we're doing. Yeah, first one is our public launch. So we're gonna launch all our solutions early this year, hopefully in late March, and we hope to make that an annual event. The second one is our better um, pre-application guide, so we're already using that in terms of guiding new applicants on the information they need to submit with new, uh, new planning permit applications. And the third one will be our customer triage sheet that we're going to give to our customer service area, hopefully to make inquiries easy for them and to reduce some of our workload as well. Uh, I think it's just given us a, a new set of documentation and a bit more guidance for our community members, for our regular users, but even our mum and dads to get a bit of a better understanding about the planning permit process and the timeframes associated with it. This is just, it's just an amazing um, set of tools, an amazing set of people, an amazing projects to be part of. Yeah, I think it's been an absolute godsend working with everybody involved, honestly. Uh, we could never have done this on our own. We haven't got the time and resources to develop fact sheets. So having like an, a product that's 99% there and you just have to insert the word silly Yarra is just amazing. So yeah, I would say just grab it with both, <laughs> grab the opportunity with both hands. If you have the opportunity, do it. You won't regret it and I just say that it opens your eyes to what other councils are doing as well. Just do it, make the time, that's very important. You don't always need everyone to attend. Make sure you have buy-in from your, your leadership and you'll find that it'll be a really beneficial experience.